Yo, guys, Urban Bars brings you the best UK reactions to rap, hip hop, and urban music from all around the world. And guys, there's a rumor that I've been told, and I think people like Raw the Helicopter and a few other people have been checking me out online and saying, Am I going to Name Wee's concert? As he's going to be appearing in the UK. Guys, that is news to me and it's good news. So guys, I'm going to check it out. I think people have been saying he might be at O2. Some people said he's going to be at the Shepherd's Bush Empire, etc, etc. If he's at the Shepherd's Bush, I'm definitely going to go, guys. That's West London. I'm born and raised in West London. I've been living out of London for many years now, guys. But if he's in West London, I'm definitely going. I don't know the times, the dates and everything, but I will find out. But guys, our man named Wee has dropped another track last night and I missed it again. How am I always missing name Wee dropping his tracks? I don't know, guys. I think it's called Encode. I don't know too much more about it, guys. But as well as name Wee coming over, and I always say our man named Wee is like the hardest working man in show business. And he is. He's always busy. He's always doing bits and pieces, whether it's new tracks, whether it's liaising and engaging with his fans or doing things or traveling the globe and just being an ambassador name we is all of that and a lot more but guys i think this track's called encode it's our man name we let's get to it yeah. sounds like it's live yes i could hear some live sounds yeah oh. yeah Oh, what's going on? And he's bringing back the old school. Wiki, wiki, wiki. The hip hop, the DJ. He's got his American flag shirt here. Really? Oh my goodness. And I'm hoping this is a DJ in the background, guys. I don't know what this is. I don't know if this is part of our man. Is it? Is it called the Big Bird Tour? It's called the Big Something Tour and I can't remember. Really? I should remember this guy, so apologies on my end, guys. But our man named Wee is, he's as busy as anything. <laughs> and he looks like one of them hip hop heads, a dread head there, you know. You know, oh my goodness. I love that American flag, star spangled banner shirt. Really? Where can I get one of them? <laughs> Really? <laughs> Doing a bit oh, of oh, yeah. oh. The best way to get a crowd going, guys. Just throw them the Luchi. Throw them the Lucra. <laughs> Just throw them the Mutter. Really? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> He's got US <laughs> glasses as well. Flipping the bird. And is that a play on words? Coochie. <laughs> Coochie. Instead of Gucci. Really? And our man named Wee is inside uh I don't know, what are these four year olds, five year olds? I don't know guys. Class like kindergarten or something, I'm not sure. <laughs> Guys, I don't think there's any subtitles in this, guys, but it's our man actually saying real words, or is he just saying alf the words of the alphabet or something? Is he just saying the, the vowel words, the vowel sounds, or is he saying consonants? I'm not sure, guys. Let me know in the comment section. I've got a funny feeling, because our man named we likes the play of us, guys. <laughs> he likes the play of us, guys. So if you know what he's saying, please let me know down here in the comment section. Because here at Urban Bars, I haven't got a Scooby-Doo. I have not got one single clue. I don't know. It sounds good, good, but I have no idea what he's saying. And <laughs> he's just a little baby, a little baby. Really? It's, what, what are these like? Little, well, they're not gummy bears, are they? But like the Care Bears and kind of stuff? I don't know. <laughs> I 
I swear he's not saying real words. I might be wrong, but it just sounds like the vowel sounds or something. But literally, he's... This kind of scene reminds me a bit of people like Missy Elliott and Buster Rhymes way back in the days, guys. These kind of scenes of the hip-hop videos they were doing back in the days. But it just reminds me, and just... I'm getting an inkling that our man is taking bits and pastiche and bits of hip-hop from all over the time. Because he was there. Was he there with an the orange? Was that a Lamborghini? And then he was there with a gangster. So he was more or less like the Tupac image, you know, with the gangster thug, thug life kind of stuff, etc., etc. And then there's all sorts of different elements of hip hop that our man's playing about with here. So this is just a bit of fun. What's it called? Encode. And I always talk about encoding, like things like communications, because when I'm speaking to you guys, I'm absolutely saying some words and I've encoded those words. So those words have been encoded because I am the sender. And you are the recipient, so you need to decode what I have encoded. So I'm not sure what this is about. This is all about communication, people. And I think maybe I'm getting it all twisted, but communication can be taken a wrong way. So you send something out with, with a plan A. So you're sending something out, you're communicating it to the people, and you're hoping they get your plan A. Well, it's not even a plan A, but, you know, the A, the A sending. <laughs> Send, ascend to rise. Anyway, not not going to talk about that. But it could be then received and then decoded. But they're not decoding it with A. They're decoding it with B. And they're getting the whole wrong emphasis on what you've just said. So I don't know, guys. I'm just I'm just messing around. I'm just funning. I'm just remembering my days from communication, guys. Really? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Really? <laughs> this has got to be gobbledygook. Really? I have no clue what this is about. I know he likes his orange, the colours there, prevalent. But just seeing the little kids with the recorders reminded me when I was at school, when I was about, I don't know, six years, seven years of age, we were taught to play the recorder, going up all them scales, etc. Really? <laughs> Brings me back when I was a kid doing these scales with the recorder. We play things like green sleeves. Really? You. So you're learning phonetics and things. <laughs> Sound like he was saying F U <laughs> Really? Was he giving him the John Cena? I don't know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Guys, 
that was more funny than words that was our man named we and that was encode guys if any of you know what that was about please let me know in the comment section i am just guessing i'm surmising i've got so much conjecture up in the house i have no clue what our man was saying or what the hidden little gems are behind that guys i can only guess and here at urban bars guys you know what happens when you guess and when you assume mm, i don't want to be that kind of person but guys whatever it was it was good i really liked it i absolutely loved the way name we approaches his music and the way name we approaches how he does his videos i've always thought from the very start whatever name we does it's really really engaging and entertaining it's funny but then you guys are the ones who told me there's a lot of deep hidden truths and deep hidden meanings inside a lot of his words so on the surface you may hear one thing but if you dig deep enough or if you are alert enough and you can actually decode what he's encoded in what he's saying you'll actually understand what name we's actually trying to convey to you and to me but guys this one was called encode <laughs> i absolutely loved it but i have to be honest and hold my hands up i don't know too much about what he was saying but guys let me know in the comment section and on those questions that you've asked me here at urban bars guys i definitely do want to go and see name we in concert seriously because between the ages of, like when i was an early teen guys all the way through to my mid-20s actually even later than that guys i used to go to concerts jams whatever you want to call them all the time we were clubbing all the time i remember telling you we were going out every single day of the week guys and sometimes two days two nights in the week whatever but listen guys all the concerts the jams the tours i've seen etc etc i've seen so many i've seen i've been lucky enough to see most of the major stars so anyone who was a star from the 80s to the 90s even to the early twos i've seen them all guys i am lucky enough to see them all i've even spoken to a lot of them as well guys so i want to get name we on that record as well so yes i will do my best to come and see name we and also i know that harry mack is touring as well so i'm going to definitely do my best to check out harry mack as well so that's in answer to your question people yes i am going to do my best to check out name we and harry mack and once i've got those confirmed i'll let you know when and where i'll be on those days so guys yeah it's going to be great so if, if, if any of you guys are coming make certain you let me know and yeah we'll hook up but guys name we encode fantastic hope you have a great whatever's left of the weekend look after yourselves look after each other make certain you look no <laughs> i'm just funny guys make certain though that you if you haven't already subscribed to my channel here at urban bars you subscribe and more importantly guys make sure and make certain you come back to the next urban bars reaction guys i love that take care of yourselves and Let's meet up for the next Urban Pass reaction, guys.